Hi guys, I'm back with another video for my reactions to WWE Clash of Champions Gold Rush 2020. The pay-per-view just ended and I'm just starting the video now. So let's get into the my reactions and the results. So the first match was the pre-show match that actually changed. Actually changed from the... From the Wall Women's Championship to actually the tag team match for the WWE SmackDown Tag Team Championships. Cesaro and Skinsky Nakamura versus the Lucha House Party winners and still SmackDown Tag Team Champions Cesaro and Skinsky Nakamura. Uh, number two was the Triple Threat ladder match for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Jeff Hardy versus AJ Styles versus Sami Zayn. Winner and new Intercontinental Champion, Sami Zayn. Um, out of the whole night, this is the only match I got wrong. So I'm pretty happy. And I got 8 out of the 9 matches right. Now if you're wondering why there's 8 out of 9, I'll get into it later in the reaction. So number 3 was the singles match for the WWE Raw Women's Championship. Asuka versus Selena Vega, winner. Rollins champion, Asuka. Uh, number four, a singles match for the WWE United States Championship. Bobby Lashley versus Apollo Crews. Winner and still WWE United States Champion, Bobby Lashley. Um, number five, the tag team match for the WWE Raw Tag Team Championships. The Street Profits versus Angel Garza. Andrade and Angel Garza, winner and still Raw Tag Team Champions. The Street Profits. Now, uh, now this is where things changes. So, the sixth, the fifth match of the night, the tag team match for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championships, Nine Jax and Shannon Baszler versus the Rye Squad. That match got canceled. So they canceled that match off the card. Now I don't know what they're gonna do. With that match, if it's going to be on Monday Night Raw or they just canceled that whole match completely, I have no idea. But if the match is on Monday Night Raw, I'll do a video on it. Monday Night Raw news. But anyway, the sixth match is Bailey versus Nikki Cross. That match was also canceled because uh, Nikki, Nikki Cross was like, they said she would wouldn't be able to do the match, so Bailey won by forfeit. And then another match happened right after where Bailey threw out an open challenge, which Oscar accepted, and Oscar won the match by disqualification. And Bailey was still Raw uh, SmackDown Women's Championship, still Raw uh, SmackDown Women's Champion because she de defended a title in that match. But I picked Oscar for that. Um, number eight was the ambulance match for the WWE Championship. Drew McIntyre versus Randy Orton, winner and still WWE Champion Drew McIntyre. Thank God Drew McIntyre won that match. I want to see, like I said earlier in my predictions video. You guys couldn't see it, but I really wanted Drew McIntyre to win the match, and he did. So I'm happy. The singles match for the WWE Universal Championship, Roman Reigns versus Jey Uso. Still WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. Uh, my opinion on this match, uh, very embarrassing. I was very embarrassed for this match. Uh, they just... Totally ruined the career of Jey Uso. Like, it was very embarrassing. I thought it would be a good match with a good storyline. But they ruined it. They ruined the whole match. It was very embarrassing. Nobody wanted to see it because it was boring. Plus, Roman Reigns was in control for the whole match. Jey Uso had some offense and he did his finisher a couple times but he couldn't beat Roman Reigns and Jimmy Uso uh, Jay Uso's brother had to come out and throw in the towel for him so I really didn't like that match 
But what was my favorite match? Well, I loved the the inter uh, the intercontinental title match and the ambulance match. I thought they were pretty good matches. I like stipulation matches. You'll know from me that I really love stipulation matches, and I think there should be stipulations in title matches. Now, I like the Intercontinental Championship specifically of how Sami Zayn won the title. It was very different. Now, the idea is not, di not different, but he, he used a creative way to do it. So, he used... Uh, 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 he used... Uh, he used uh, he used police police cuffs, and he uh, he uh, he he uh, police cuffed uh, Jeff Hardy's ear to the the ladder because if you don't know uh, Jeff Hardy wears one of those ear pieces on his ear, and Sami Zayn hooked the the police cuffs to his ear and he. Yeah, pretty much uh, police, police cuffed his ears to the ladder. And then he also, uh, well, Sami Zayn had the key, so he handcuffed himself to AJ Styles, so he couldn't climb the ladder. But what Sami Zayn did was, after AJ Styles was on the ladder and Jeff Hardy was fighting with him, he, he used the key to unlock himself and chain uh, AJ Styles to the ladder. And that's how he won the match. Uh, what is the match of the night? I, I would say the ambulance match. Drew McIntyre versus Randy Orton. I did not like the Universal Championship match. Very embarrassing. I didn't like it. So I wish that match was five minutes actually. The match was more than five minutes. It was actually 25, which very surprising, but I didn't like it. But anyway, what did you think? What did you guys think of my predictions and reactions for WWE Class of Champions Gold Rush 2020? Please post a comment. And if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and comment. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.